All right, oh, I, uh, I started a new recording. Yeah, there we go. Not that there were any technical difficulties before this. It's totally fine. But uh, hypothetically, let's say five minutes. I'm sorry, but Forest Sea Studios is the centerpiece of technical difficulties. Always. <laughs> That's on the iceberg. Wait, is it on the iceberg? That, no, actually, no, I didn't put that on there. I probably should have. <laughs> you, you added, like, all the most obscure <laughs> stuff for you. Technical <laughs> difficulties. <laughs> Dang. We, we had okay, technical so we difficulties got... screen. Uh, okay, Jackbox 9. This came out, like, a month ago, but we missed it. Or I didn't want to spend $25 on it, so. Not yet. I, I, think, I, got, I think I got it on a little bit of a sale, at least. But uh, it's me and Jack and Sandy and Darian, and we're going to try these all for the first time. I guess we should yeah. start with the obvious fib fibbage four, right? Yeah, yeah. Let's do fibbage four first. Oh, I gotta get my, I gotta get my shit going. Uh, is there a drawing game this time? I assume yeah. so. There's always a drawing know, game. There is. I don't know which one it is. Perfect. Yes. <laughs> By the way, YouTube is actively targeting like chan channels retroactively for swearing in like the first eight seconds. I yeah, uh, I'm aware of that because. Uh, Achievement Hunter, or Let's Play, they uh, they censor for like the first 60 seconds of their videos, and then they just stop. Oh yeah. Uh, I consider it, I don't have any plans of following YouTube's thing. It's just like, oh, you won't get monetized. And be like, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, we're 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 not gonna get monetized anyway. I don't give a Markiplier fuck. Markiplier doesn't seem to care. Markiplier uh, has merch. He's What's up, everybody? Probably... It's me, Markiplier. How the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Who needs monetization? You have backpacks. He played Cruelty Squad recently, and he was so confused throughout. It was great. Okay, Jackbox said to me. You can still hear me, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I can okay, hear you. Cool. We can hear you. We're just ignoring you. Wow. Play Fibbage. Oh, that, that's the, like, personal... There's, like, a personal Oh, yeah, that's mode the one we the tried that other day, yeah. Did, we, did we ever we try that? Fibbage. One time, yeah. Did you select it? No, I didn't. Okay. Alright. Because the past is proven, sadly, we cannot trust the audience. There you go. There's the room code, you guys. Mesothelioma. Who wants to buy ten attack work gloves? I own a tablet now. I haven't set it up, but I'm not going to use it, but I own one. Is it an drawing. iPad or is it like a? I, I don't know. Or a Joy Tab. Oh no! I'll beat this guy. Well, what was the occasion? Uh, no, I did. Uh, I inherited it. Oh. I already forgot the code. Can one of you guys type it? Isothelioma. <laughs> I thought it was no. this, but Jackbox is saying room code not found. Replace uh, the last uh, letter with a uh, okay, circular yeah. letter. I, I got it. I got you. <laughs> That's why we kept saying mesothelioma. Nobody, please beat a moth. I hate that thing. Pick your creature. Oh, you don't like moths, do you? I can't stand them. Oh, God. Hmm, don't go to Paris. Yes, Shadow Moth disapproves. <laughs> Nobody Eisen turned a into moth. a moth. We just finished I'm Bleach. Well, we finished the part of Bleach that matters. The, the be the frog part. bat. Bat frog. All right, well, that's all four of us. I think I've got... I'll, I'll just... I'll be platypus. Eisen, Eisen went through like eight different forms in the span of, of 20 episodes. He had more forms than Frieza has now, as of Dragon Ball Super. You know that if you die in Fibbage 4, you die in real life. I don't know that's not that. That's when moving. Who's a. Jack is just a skull. Yeah. Jack Skullington. Damn it, I should have named. Watching, you can join the audience at any time. <laughs> I guess these are just a bunch of mythical creatures. Like I mean, the I'm skull. a frog. The mythical skull. Yeah, the skull has paws. The mythical paw skull. Alright, round That's one. That's not disturbing. Slightly unsettling motif for this fibbage. Yeah. So, uh, as usual. Points don't matter until the very last round. It's all that counts. Yeah. Select a category. Darian. All right, what's the category? Okay. Let's go with the uh... odd job. He's banned. Don't take too long, otherwise it'll yeah. just freeze. Yeah, I got yeah. it. I got it. First up, 
Let's hear it for John Peterson. From 1999 until 2014, it was his job and his job alone to clean and punish. All right. Type in your lies now. Enter a bluff on your device. That sounds real mm. enough to trick. Remember, your goal players. is to uh, trick stopped, people into voting for your answer as the truth. Yeah. Using it's only worth half the points. Unless you say fuck it and just go for the thumbs cup. That's also an option. Yeah. I'm on the spot. Alright, uh, like 10 seconds. I got my frog. There's a winged frog. It's a spiral frog. Five, I'm okay with this. Four. Gotcha. Alright. His job alone to clean and polish the Queen's face, all the windows, turds, the Hollywood Walk of Fame, or Kenny Omega's pants. Ooh! Wait, no, if he wasn't, wasn't active Jack, in 99. Then, if that wasn't Jack, then it's someone trying very hard to appeal to Jack. Yeah. Good, nice try, but I, I know more <laughs> about wrestling than you do. Let me guess it's this one. I don't know how big the Hollywood Walk of Fame is. Is that a big job? Did anybody, did everybody pick? Okay, there we go. Yeah. Show me what you picked. I probably should have picked that. Turds. No. It probably was not turds. Why would turds need to be polished? Yeah, it's a polished turd. A that was a pun. Turd. Yeah, it was, that wasn't even a, a real answer. That has to be it. Yeah, it was. Yeah. It was a metaphor. Well, That's why I polish a turd is still a turd. The thing is, is that that was what I was going to say because I didn't know. <laughs> but then I'm just like, oh, that's there. I'm like, that actually seems. Like well, I feel silly. <laughs> all the windows. I, I blanked out at that time. I'm sorry. It's all about quick wit. All right, time for me to choose a category. Oh, likes get you points. Not so friendly, of course. How about this? Legend has it that a creature haunts the government buildings of buildings Washington, Washington. D.C. in the U.S., roaming the empty halls at night. This creature oh, God. Is not only as <laughs> blank. Okay, enter those lies. Right on the cusp of that. We don't have a lot of. Is, I, I didn't see if there was an extended timer settings. We don't have a lot of time for this one. It's just. It's not like it's pictures. It's just uh, letters and words. I like we'll give it a presentation. All right. That creature is known as Franken Teddy, Demon Cat, ABDL Furries, Richard Nixon, Bill Clinton. <laughs> uh, well, shit. Ooh, I'm a ghost moment. here to haunt you. Hey, let's go make some white water. I am not a crew, a ghost. <laughs> Charles didn't <Dinsu. laughs> All right, now let's unmask the Richard Dixon. Shoes are great. All right, now let's unmask this Richard Nixon creature and see who it is. Let's Bill do. Clinton. It can't be an actual name, can it? What? <laughs> Jack. Thanks, thanks, Darian. I really appreciate that. Okay, damn, damn it. Frank and Roosevelt wouldn't fit. So it was Demon Cat. Has to be. It's ABDL furries, guys. Come on. Yeah. Hey, I don't know. I know what that means. I have. Who is? Who, I, want, I know I it's like the ghost of Lincoln Clark. is a famous myth. Yeah, but he, I, he had a cat, I guess. Hey, it's time to laugh at some dead people. What? <laughs> dead person. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Okay. It doesn't look Her, right. Had a sugar mama relationship with a Tchaikovsky, the uh, ballet or opera writer? Yes. One, she'd give him a monthly allowance. Two, they would never blank. Write your lies now. I'm on a roll now. I, I've, I've broken through my funk from the first question. Okay. 
so I know it's not that, so that means... Oh, I'm curious now what the uh, actual answer is. Ten seconds. Five seconds. I had to. I don't even know what to say for this one. <laughs> I had to fucking pick a lie. They would never marry. They would never listen to pro wrestling on the radio. <laughs> they would never meet. never meet. They would never pose for portraits, or they would never have sex. It's a oh, shitty this is sugar mama. That's this is actually fascinating. Hmm. That's too obvious, right? Never have sex. I was trying to I think of know. a funny composer name because there's like a couple composers that have like suggestive names. So I was trying to think of one. All right, we're out of time. Of Whoever did choose, they did choose. Moment of truth. Oh wow! Okay. Oh, we got. We fell we for the almanite. Believe it or not. <sighs> okay, so it was an emo a long distance emotional affair. That's pretty good. No one Fortress got it. Is pretty good, Dairy. <laughs> that seems like likely. You want to keep that shit a secret. I am in last place. That's kind of rare for these games. Hello. What are those fish? They're, they're, dancing. they're pants fish. Hey, look, it's round two. With that human feet. It's, uh, this game is ass. <laughs> All right, uh, All right. Sandy picks category. category. Don't take too long. Unlikely duos. Oh, us. Let's see what we got. Yes. We're, we're a quartet, Jack. Frank Sinatra and Willie Nelson recorded an ad where they admitted they disagree on fashion, but we do share the same feeling about. Blank. Oh boy. Admit your lies now. Oh boy. Recorded an ad. Don't I can't I can't name any Willie Nelson songs. I'm sure I know some. I I the only uh, time I've ever seen Willie Nelson wasn't even in a music video or listened to his music, but it was on an episode of Monk. I know Johnny was, Cash, like, where he was like a culprit, but it turned out to be a blind lady. Okay, it was Ray Charles all along. <laughs> Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Uh, so five. Four, Four, three, three two, two, two one. There we go. Down to the wire. All right. We do share the same feeling about whiskey, <laughs> about liberals, about racism, about space technology, or about politics. Oh shit! I do, now I don't know what it is. <laughs> is it really? Oh, that sounds like a Darian answer, though. Um, what would be more likely to be in a TV ad? Whiskey or, or racism or politics? Okay, it's gotta be this. Hmm, oh, probably, that was confusing as fuck. I don't know. Okay, it's not that one. Who got that? Yes, Sandy. good job, Sandy. Darn. I shouldn't have been so specific. <laughs> I put in liberals. Yay. <laughs> that wasn't it. Okay. Probably whiskey. Gotta be whiskey. Nope, it's mine. Oh. <laughs> Jack! <laughs> Actually, you know what you guys are working really space technology? Fly me to moonshine. <laughs> I thought that was Darian's answer, because that seemed like an answer Darian would, would post. It was the 80s, it was a space race, right? Yeah. Well, I said it was after yeah. the space race. Yeah, it's just, so, like it's just so weird, too. Yeah, ignore me. As long as it's on the clock. All right. Okay. The tone of the music does not fit the tone of the visuals. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, the visuals are screwed up. Fan fact, let's see what's this. I'm Stephanie from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Hi, Stephanie. After years of promises, well, more like comical threats from family members. My grandmother is buried with. Okay. Answer your lies now. My grandmother was buried with. After oh. comical threats from family family members. After. Does this imply that they succumbed to the family members? 
Okay, I, I posted my answer. Hello, Cure Ribbon. Oh, whoops. And that leaves Sandy, I think. No, or Zell. I'm the frog. Zellrog. He so he should have been Zell Frog. Well, I mean, we didn't know so. Now, My grandmother it. was buried with honor, with a pee in her nose, <laughs> with her stripper boots, with Elvis Presley, or with her cat. Okay, I know exactly what this is. A pee in her nose. That is a very she specific was answer. With <laughs> honor. What is she calling on? <laughs> Kapla! <laughs> they have to pay a lot to have her buried with Elvis. Like with Elvis, like like together in the same coffin, or just Let's near Elvis? Just... It's like next to him. It was the threats that did it. She was Aww. not buried with her stripper boots, but thank Sorry. you. Sorry, Stephanie from Philadelphia. I assumed a lot about your grandmother. Don't hate me. Uh, thank you, Zellrock. It, it actually it, what has to be comical too. threats. A pee in her nose. She was buried with a pee in her nose. What? Why? Why is it was that an the inside truth? joke? Oh, okay. I brought a pee to the funeral home to do it myself. But when I got to the you castle, are a very strange woman. There was already one in her nose. Oh. Okay. You are very strange. This is sadistic. <laughs> I, mean, I was if I left a final I request to be buried with a pee in my nose, I'd, I'd be yeah. happy it was followed through on. <laughs> Wait, you guys said Elvis? What's our next category? No, we just no, we thumped thumped up. Oh. Civil no, I got No, civil suit, sorry. <sighs> it's because Elvis was my answer, but because I'm the one that picked the correct answer, I got the most points out of that, that's why. put a sign out on her front porch above her running shoes. The sign read, Caution, these shoes are the summer home of blank. All hmm. right, type in your Elvis. Uh, if you'd like to, you can go to jackbox.tv and type in the code in the top left to join the audience. It does different things depending on the game. I don't know what the audience does in this game. I still need to watch uh, the uh, old anime Dirty Pair. Yeah. I, uh, uh, there's uh, there's apparently an OVA or movie or something that looks really good. And I want to watch the original series to like you know get context. All right, two of you need to put in your answers right the fuck now. <laughs> Thank you, appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> These shoes are the summer home of Jabba the Toad, my Aunt Demia's foot fe fetish, fire ants, Buck Bumble, or my bees. It's gotta be this one. How does a foot fetish have a summer home? <laughs> it's a joke. You know, like the pee up the nose. Yeah, pee up the nose? I don't know. Also, who the who fuck is Buck Bumble? Who hasn't picked yet? Pick something. Pick something, please. Oh, I guess it's the uh, chat. Buck, Buck Bumble is like a N64 platformer. It was not my bees. No. I Fine. figured it wouldn't be. Fire ants. Thanks again, Zorok. Man. <laughs> Jack knows me. Jabba. Pass me this one. Yeah. Why? <laughs> Why? What, what, dude? Well, I mean, it just like, likes animals, to live in, animals live in weird places. Like. I pulled slightly ahead. Let's see what final image does. It's time for the I do like the visuals. The visuals are pretty cool. Eclectic. Yeah. Good luck. In 2018, an Ohio judge sent to stand at an intersection wearing a sign that read blank. Oh, that could be anything. Oh, but Smash Ultimate came out in 2018. Wait, are these supposed to be the same? 
that sounds like it might fit in either of these two. Oh, oh okay. this is clever. Double the chance to fool your fellow players. And if it's believed a racehorse could be named fucking anything. <laughs> like literally, the name could be fucking anything. Some extra time. You'll be fine. <laughs> I'm not gonna write that down. You spoiled that. Shit. Right. Okay, this is gonna take some time. Uh. <laughs> Queensland is in Australia, right? I think. Yeah. So, so somebody was smuggling meth in a in a Australian racing horse, and it happened to have the same name as a. Uh, so, as a sign that a guy was wearing two years later. Was he the guy? Was he sentenced for the previous crime? Uh, somebody enter, enter it, please. Thank you. Cutting close. Okay, wearing a sign that read, Party Till Dawn. Naughty boy. Fucking anything. <laughs> I steal money. I am a bully. Or I blast for boobs. So these are... On a sign, oh. and also the name of a racehorse. Okay, so this one, the left one is the one you're answering now, I guess. Okay, uh, so they're potentially different. A uh, racehorse named... Uh, I'm gonna say it's that one. Has to be that one. Okay. Let's move on to this question. Pick the Very short timers for this one. This question now. Yeah, we didn't turn on extended timers. It's probably for the best. I... Alright, this one's the sign. Naughty. What if it's both? Both is just the one. Could be. Okay. Alright. I cannot wait to see what the... Uh, what the thing is. Alright. Okay, what everybody pick? Alright. I steal money for the left. For the right one. Oh, it's... Oh, I, I was the it. one who ran out of time. Glad I got <laughs> that two. That's pretty good for, the, for a random one. They... The racehorse party till dawn. Yes! Yeah. That was... A naughty boy was too normal a name for a racehorse. And I guess I am a... Oh, yeah. yep. Cool. I think I got both. Ironically, bullies used to call yeah, you won then. Till PM. Oh, was this the, the final... The one that count final matters? Final footage! Yeah, we should have <laughs> gone with the joke and said fucking anything. <laughs> Look at that point difference. Nothing fucking matters until the final round. Yeah. Sandy won the light cup. Good job, Sandy. All right. All right, next game. That's... I like... I like, uh, Jackbox game. Fibbage 4 uh, is basically Fibbage 1 through 3, except they... This seems to be the, the most streamlined. I like the hey. final version. I like the bunny, but the visuals are cursed. Yeah. The visuals are great. So, rumoring. What is this one about? I have no idea what any of these other games are. Okay. Or which one is the drawing game. Uh, I the volume just a little bit. Try to check accessibility and gameplay for extended timers. I feel like we need this. Yeah. Oh, no timers! <laughs> no, thank you. Yeah, the problem with that is I, like, I, what I if mean, someone, think, like, disconnects? I think you could trust it. It's just us four. But, yeah, it, if someone does disconnect, that's going to be a problem. I wonder Remember what when that completely destroyed the push-the-button game? Yeah. Just like, please, someone vote. No. All right. If the house is full, you can always join the audience at jackbox.tv. Confirm your name. 
choose a detail about your character. Oh. Sure. <laughs> oh, someone picked the old potato. Uh. You know what? I'll be Peridot from Steven Universe. Damn it. <laughs> I was gonna... Oh, uh... you're gonna pick her? Yeah, okay, I'll be t I'll be Two Face. No, old I'll, potatoes I'll be, open or again. I'll be purple peridot. <laughs> I I look like a little bit like my head on Parappa. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let me know when you're ready, Sandy. All right, I'm ready. Big booty Judy. <laughs> Big <laughs> booty Judy. Hey, start, go. Alright, how does this game work? We have to like listen to the intro now. Where you're one foot in the hot tub and one foot out the door. Yeah. I'll be your host, here to guide you through a game that's a Oh, it's a reality TV, TV game. Fuck of off. Personalities. This game is played in five rounds. Oh, you are coming into this game with a detail about yourself that you selected in the lobby. If you didn't pick one, I went ahead and did that for you. This is the role you will be playing, so play it up in your answers, or completely Fuck, what was mine? go after each other. I'm That's fine, I'll show it probably. It's on the top of the screen. Favor with your fellow players by I'll answering your questions or in a funny way, device. a genuine way, or a brutal way, where you stare them in the eye while... Oh, this ought to be good. Drama. Okay, so our goal okay, is to be liked, I guess. But it also to uh, keep in theme with the thing on the top. Broadway star. star. I'm She's a super artist and Fitting. restaurant critic. Oh, I can see that. Game with five points. It's fucking raw! It's raw! Idiot sandwich! Yes, chef. And lost if you are eliminated. But yes, chef. What? The total's a secret until the very end. How about we rumorang? Yes, chef! Yes, chef! Oh, hey, uh, don't go into a private oh, hey, island, Zellrog. <laughs> Round one. Introductions. The entrance to the room. What was that movie? Is surrounded the, by the menu. Manager. I still, I still want to to everyone to watch it once we get sure to avoid. Surrounded by danger, which chapter are you making sure to avoid? All right. Answer the prompt on your The device. entrance is surrounded Remember by danger. Which hazard are you making sure to avoid? Details about yourself and other players are always fair game. Uh -huh. This actually has the has the uh, potential to be really fun. Let's see how it plays out. I was gonna say Sandy is Madame Flurry. I mean. True. The star. I don't know exactly what I'm doing. I'm just going with it right now. That, these timers are very extended. Yeah, very extended. Gives you time to think. Mm, yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's do it. All right, Sandy, the Broadway star. Avoids running and slipping on an ice cube. Okay. I am avoiding Big Booty Judy's Big Booty. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Jack is avoiding the Kraken. And Darian is avoiding the Garden Gnomes. I don't want to ruin the paint on their pointy hats. So, out of the four of us, two of us Which understood the assignment. <laughs> Vote on your device now. I, it's just the best answer, however you want to interpret that. It can but be whether the, they the, stick to the, their thing or whether you just like them. Well, yeah, but the gimmick of the game, like the, like the point of the game is that you pick the theme of your character and they want you to basically answer each question as if you are that character specifically. It's like, like, oh, it's like it's They like outlined very and... clearly that it was very loose. It's like, play however you want to play. Oh yeah, I mean, so, yeah. So that means that except we do drawful, you add words to the to the uh, pictures. No. Okay. Then no, that's uh, different. My my case. Point for each vote. Jack, if you want to vote based on that, that's great. You do that. You can do that. <laughs> yeah. It's just the game is the game is like tailor designed in the fact like oh since I'm the artist I gotta answer everything like I'm an artist. It, they, so you know, if you want to play like that, that way, you oh, can. You know? 
<laughs> I can. Just just try to be on team elimination a little time bit. Has arrived. Oh, who's gonna be eliminated? And that kind of makes it challenging too, because it's like, okay, how would I react in this situation if I was a restaurant like, critic or I was a submarine captain? How would I talk like this? The player you voted for is successfully eliminated. You steal a point from them. I think y'all are just deciding for yourselves what the game is. That's what the game said in the introduction. You guys or don't. I'm not your mother. I won't stop you. Play Watch how you want to play. Alright, now we gotta do our uh, our big brother vote. Yes, yeah. yeah. My vote is for X. The eliminated player is... Damn. Oh, yes! come on. <laughs> Y'all are bitches. Let's find out. Gotta play by the rules, boy. Oh, come on! There are no rules! You made them up! <laughs> And I sent who voted yeah. to eliminate you. And we don't like your answer because it's not on point. <laughs> <laughs> it was not mean to me about how to play the game. Private bank. Learn from this pain. Sandy's <laughs> mad I was trying to dodge the booty. Before you go out the door, now is your chance to say any final words to your former. You all friends. fucking suck. <laughs> We're never playing this again. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> this had so much potential to be fun. Come on. This is like an end game interview where they like, yeah, screw. <laughs> Here you guys, I'm going to of that. Gone but not forgotten. Oh, I've, I've already forgotten. Well, this is unexpected. Oh, you're going to be a new character? You know, yeah. fresh blood. Oh, he's just Get in here, new roomie. Okay. Zalrog. Zalrog. It's me, Token. Zalrog. Oh, come on. about yourself. So what do I know? You, you don't like Lord of the Rings? You don't and like You know Hobbit? that J.R.R. Token was like super religious. It's kind, kind of yeah. a jerk Die in some ways. He's <laughs> also very racist, I get what you're saying. You got another player for the secret gift exchange. What? What are you getting them? Uh, he actually wanted to uh, outlaw divorce because uh, he was such a hardcore Christian. Advice. Just FYI. See, not, see, now you're getting it. <laughs> All right, secret gift exchange. What are you getting this person? Aware that you're half there you through your time. <laughs> All right, I can't wait. I, I'm hoping that my gift is pretty cool. Let's see. Can't believe that Zelrog guy got vote, voted off immediately. Sounds like a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about him and his refusing to follow the game, Zal? Follow Zalrog. The oh, we're out of time. Okay. Darian gives Jack a new compass since a sperm whale ate his other one. <laughs> Thank you, that's nice of you. Gives Zalrog lost Nazi <laughs> gold and an Enigma device from a sunken U-boat. I All give right. Sandy extra large pants adorned with giant faux peacock feathers. There oh, that, that's go. actually really useful. Simon Belmont trans nudie mags with booba chains and kinky pains. Okay. I know which answer I have. <laughs> How about you? That's... Vote on your device now. What what kind of artist is Darian? <laughs> Paradarian. Uh... I really... <laughs> I This time I didn't understand the assignment, I just... <laughs> 
I, I what I should have gotten uh, Zalrog, who's totally not Zalrog, a uh, a uh, like the fanfic where it was from the orcs' perspective. Oh, should have gotten some Harry Potter books. Here's our shiny <laughs> new winner, and when you get mentioned in this round, you get points too. That's the uh, the fusion between Peridot and Amethyst. We never got yeah. that Velma. It must be a player who voted. That's right. They fuse and become Velma. Time to decide who your real allies are. Oh, oh, she's gonna eliminate. Or Darian's gonna eliminate someone. Nation time. Let that sink in. Well, for, the for this round, you want eliminated. The eliminated player is. I can see where this is going. Everybody looks like they got hit by that one devil fruit from One Piece. Oh, hey, at least I had that Castlevania oh, respect, awesome. damn it. The art, art, yeah, I mean, I like it. Darian likes that answer, but respect. the artist buddy doesn't. Sandy's character, <laughs> My character like, doesn't. I watched the whole anime, though. I learned everything about Castlevania. Exactly. So get out of here. Anime. That's. You have any last words? You know, J.R.R. Tolkien speechless. would have been a fan of the Castlevania anime. <laughs> he didn't even strip. Uh, till... uh, uh. Oh, issue three. There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, cool. I miss them already. And what's your new character gonna be? Who could that be? Glasses. A hat. A hat. <laughs> Is it Cindy? Sandy. Sorry. Sandy. Sandy. It's my new OC. Let's go. Oh, the sappiness. Sandy Dragons. It's, it's your nobody name. <laughs> All right, Jargon. I smell war. Let's go. Okay. You don't like confrontation, so you write something out in pasta on the kitchen counter. What do you write? In pasta, huh? Well, this is perfect for my character. In the dark. Answer okay. Prompt, but when it's time to vote, you won't know who wrote what. Well, is this in character? Apparently, we all don't like confrontation. You are done already. I still gotta. Lots of thoughts, lots of feelings. All right. May Neptune strike you dead, Winslow. Hark! Your house decor is boring. <laughs> <laughs> the Hobbit really didn't need to be three whole movies. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Watch your back, Belmont. Okay. Which response I don't do see a Belmont here. Now? I see an artist. Put on your device now. I wonder who wrote each of these. Hmm. So, Zelrog, are you done? Oh, like, sorry, picking... I'm picking which one I like. <laughs> I just outed him! How do you know it's good, Zelrog? Oh! Okay. Yeah, I figured. Oh no, it's Zelrog and Sandy. <laughs> Wait, does that mean they liked ours? You should get the advantage. Yeah. The winner! Aw. Oh. Your elimination vote will count as two votes. Ooh! It's time for an elimination. Fair? No. Delicious? Yes. Vote for a player to be eliminated from the game.
This game is actually really fun because yeah. we're three D characters. It's like kind of like role playing. It's like like playing like a tabletop role playing game. What? I, fi I, who voted for you. I figured that would happen. I played by the rules, boy. You should have watched your back, Belmont. I'm hearing from production that there was a tie, so they had to go. To <laughs> what? Oh. It was the wrong would have wanted. <laughs> Anything you want to say? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, he's right. <laughs> Enough. I approve. Is this the part where they defuse and she comes back as Peridot? Goodness. Yeah. <laughs> All right. is, what's, now what's, what's my nobody name gonna be? Is it gonna be oh. actually Darian now? Hello, <laughs> Please be, be Darian. 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 Oh, <laughs> Close enough. The sassy yeah. cartographer. But is he silent? Round four. They even gave me the Barret too. The fire starter round. Ooh, what's this gonna be? House makeover night. Okay. Give another player a piece of advice to change their look. Okay. Select the player you want to write about on your device and then answer the prompt. Sassy cartographer. The time is up. Plan accordingly. By the way, Sandy's uh, character was that they love sappiness, but yeah. uh, <clears throat> but they, they've all they've done is just is just uh, trash Belmont. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so they're not really. No, that was Sandy. You're thinking of. <laughs> yeah. Who's who's Sandy? Hmm, suspicious. Every, I feel like I'm surrounded by familiar strangers. You know, when you first spoke, I thought you said uh, Sanji, and I was very confused. <laughs> uh, Darian, you still need to input your answer. Ten seconds. D. Ryan. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. I'm at a loss. <laughs> Happens. I should trim my mustache to look like Tom Selleck. Bitch, that's actually good advice. <laughs> Jack. Shave your face, put on fake elf ears, dye your hair blonde. I hope that I... Get an eye patch or something. Sell the captain look. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Jack should paint your sub yellow and become the fifth beetle. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> Which answer it's good, captured actually. your heart? Vote on your device now. Man, that's, that's actually it's time to join one. the winning team. Team Star! We didn't, we didn't speak about uh, Dirian or Sandy because they are already perfect. But we already know who's going to win this one. Let's yeah. See those no, we don't. Yes, we, yeah, we do. The scores are always... <laughs> oh, this that round. I thought you meant the other round. Yeah, that, that was a creative answer. And if you got mentioned, it's you not get how Beatles are spelled, but... Yay, I get points too! Woo! Oh yeah, you're right. You get it? It's a pun, because be Beatle. Very clever. Yes! <laughs> so, we got to eliminate... Time to thin the herd. Oh, I just realized I'm a sassy cartographer now, okay? I didn't pay attention to that. I don't know if you know, I hate J I hate J.R. Tolkien, but I'm a big fan of the Beatles. 
Well, I only get one choice. Yeah, same here. <laughs> what if I just don't click any anything? That is your prerogative. But then I have to wait the timer out. Did it tell us that we would only have one choice? I wasn't reading. through your time. Does it I guess it just decides who we're going to vote to eliminate and we have to come up with a reason maybe? Was that the idea? I I, I don't know. I guess we're going to find out. I'm assuming everyone got a different person to pick, so we're going to see how this goes. Yeah. Let's see exactly who turned on you. I mean, it, I didn't what? have... Okay. Why? <laughs> I only had one name. <laughs> yeah, so did I. <laughs> I think the game was rigged against you. I didn't read the Silmarillion because it was, it was, it's, it's propaganda. <laughs> Are you going to come back with a mustache and a hat? Or are you just going to He's going to be the Monopoly guy. <laughs> okay, we <laughs> get it. Nothing will be the same. He's going to come oh, back no. with a monitor. Cool. So next round is round. This economy? <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's just Tagoro now. <laughs> it's Chip Skylark. I'm Zorok. I've never met an old person, and I'm only using 70% of my power. <laughs> they all died because you got near them. I'm so proud of most of you. I like this game, actually. Yeah, this, one, this is a good one. This, this, is, a, this is a hit. I'm gonna play this, I'm gonna get this game and play this with my family. To everyone that you and you alone deserve to win. Hold on for dear life. It's the finale round. Sponsored by This is our New Year's episode, by the way. We just I guess it is so much. I want you to think about everything that's happened. This journey coming to an yeah, end. Yeah, 2022. Ask yourself, how can you live with yourself? <laughs> Getting philosophical now. win okay plenty to discuss all right let's see. all right how can you live with yourself easy i draw a map of my life and just follow it from there duh by not being near old people it maintains my youth and demon energy nice. <laughs> good. i help mario on his quest for the treasure of doors thousands of marios very sad of you the screams of my fellow sailors keep awake at night. <laughs> Take me, Neptune! <laughs> I spelled that final shit. Vote. Who do you think should win Rumorang? Vote on your device now. Uh, that was, I like that one the best. Jurassic Park is a documentary, really. Yeah, don't you know? They, uh, you heard about the. Honestly, who do you think should absolutely not win? Not win. Sandy and I got our answers in immediately. Okay, let's see who was really there for you. And who took one last chance to hold you back? 
Thanks. I, I knew it. Of course. I have enemies. Now, let's add up the points you what do y'all have against Sondi? Okay, I know where. What's Sondi got against me? Three points. Ten points. Oh, no! Oh, took you the final two. Who won? Oh boy. Who won? Uh, oh, yay! Dumb alien. <laughs> Yarr! Maybe I can live with myself in the screams of my <laughs> dead sailor. He's that too nice. Yeah. Thar she blows. That is a good game. Yeah, I like this game. This is, this, I think it was my favorite so far. I don't like it. Dumb game. <laughs> I just <laughs> targeted! Alright, next I, game. I, I think it's mighty creative. Yeah, I like it. I really do like it. It's long, though. Alright, what else we got? Junktopia. 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 Is this the drawing game? This looks like a drawing game. Yay, I'm ready for like a drawing game. Like we're gonna draw game. strange artifacts. Not a trap. Cool. I think the settings are pretty much the same across games, yeah. Yeah. Why, you yep. Change okay. max players, why would you? It's four. To get the amount of people that are in the call right now. Yeah. You fools. Oh, what? Don't be mean like that, bro. How does your group want to showcase their writing? Auto present or manually present? Oh, okay, so we have to we have to this is one of those games like the invention game. Yeah, fair enough. Uh I'll do manual. <clears throat> These kinds of games are usually better if you present your own thing. Alright, we good? Yeah. We are all frogs. Frogs in hats. And I'm brown. Oh yeah, this is the same. He looks like a Star versus character. He looks like the wizard from Ugly Americans, but even uglier. <laughs> Damn, that's a show I haven't thought about in a while. I gotta rewatch that. Oh, it's Ida from Owl House. First, I'll take you to a local shop to buy a mysterious item. Then you're gonna name that item and give it some funny details. Make me laugh, gosh darn Okay, so this is a game where we play as the pelican from The Little Mermaid. Your silly item, yeah. so your <laughs> the dingle hopper. The money you paid for your item will be subtracted from the appraisal value, and voila, you flipped it for a profit. Hopefully, so we flip items to make it, like, better. We have wins. to... Think write a convincing like argument for why something is cooler than it is, I guess? Yeah, it, we're, it's bullshit or the game. We're bullshitting. To pick your Mementos. Mementos. Okay, workshop. The badge is a nice touch. You'll see three items to choose from. The Them uh, Louisiana wizards. Be appraised based on the funny backstories you're gonna write. So buy something you think you can make hilarious. Buying okay, funny. It has to be funny. Item means you'll get just a little bit less profit when you flip it. When it comes to winning, there's more than one way to skin a unicorn. You fool! Don't do that shit. Okay, we're shopping. Okay. So I'm guessing the uh, items with more comedic potential tend to be more to play, expensive. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's fascinating. Uh. Ooh. Okay. No, I'll buy it. So ends our shopping experience. Shake off that regret. It's making you sweaty. I like how none of us are using our uh, our hands on the shopping carts. No, we're just Frog hands. Over. Yeah. It's funnier. Now it's time to flip these babies. Let's start with a name. 
What should people scream in terror when they see your item? All right, name for your item. Okay, I'm ready to sell my item to you, and I hope you will buy the buy it for the maximum amount because it is worth it. Next, dream up two hilarious facts about your item. For each fact, you can either fill in one of two prompts or write something of your own. Spin me a tale. Your time starts now. Get hopping. All right, here we go. Two facts about my item. All right, I am, my object is ready to be appraised. Oh, oh what's man. our timer like? We have sixty-nine seconds left. Nice. It's a. It's a. What's his name? Hisagi. That's his uh, favorite number. He has it tattooed on his face. That's literally all we know about his character. His character is that, and he also seems like he wants to be a ladies' man. He's also very helpful. All right. You have 45 seconds. <laughs> this thing, man. 30 seconds. Prosciutto conjunctivitis. Time's up. No, we submitted everything. What are you talking about? Uh... Swallow that shame. It's time to learn about your objects. All right, let's learn about the objects that everyone. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm up. Okay, cool. Uh, I am ready. All right, you guys, you guys ready for my uh, for my presentation? Yes. Cool. All right. So uh, this is my piece. Uh, this is the thing I I bought, but it's not a really a thing. It's a person, and he has a name. Uh, and you got to respect his name. His name is. Uh, Satan, Satan, Satan. First name Satan, middle name Satan, last name Satan, and uh, and he's he's quite he's quite nice, quite a uh, genial, and uh, he and you might think, oh, that's just that's probably just like a name, but the fact of the matter is, it's literally the devil himself. Um, yeah, and he smells of brimstone. You got to get used to that, but otherwise, he's immaculately dressed. But the thing that really sells uh, will sell you on him is the fact that. He will do literally anything asked of him. Anything. You want him to kill somebody, he will do it. You want him to cook a nice meal, he will do that. And he and because we're paying with fiat currency instead of souls, it won't cost you a thing. And he will do whatever it takes to do it. Uh, so yeah. Question. Yeah. Are you absolutely sure you did not get Satan confused with Waluigi? <laughs> no, he's Satan. <laughs> okay. All right, Sandy, show me your item. All right. What the uh, fuck? Uh, this um, is a item that I... It's it's a one-of-a-kind item, really. And um, yeah. before I say anything else, I do want to reveal the name of it. It's called the Eco-Friendly GPS. <laughs> um, <laughs> one, one of the best things about having an economically viable global point navigation system is 
you can reach your destination faster by simply crumbling it up because that's less you have to travel when you use the GPS, right? Um, there's also a lot of secrets involved. Uh, one of them is uh, you can get to the Earth's core conveniently located at the South Pole. Um, you just jump in and boom, you fall to the Earth's core. Question. Yes. Um, you know, you know the Earth's core is at the South Pole, right? <laughs> well, no, but that's the entrance. That looks more like a glob than a globe. Well, because it's got shortcuts. It, okay, never mind. You there, Darian? Yep. All right. Uh, you ready? You ready to show us your? Uh, All right, here your... we go. Ooh. All right. So this item you. that I have here. When I saw this on the shelf, I knew I had to pick it. It immediately caught my eye, and I knew for a fact I had to buy this. What I have here is Pill Cosby's finest. Pill Cosby. <laughs> Pill Cosby. Okay. The reason why it's called Pill Cosby's Finest is because it actually belonged to a certain fellow, you all might know him, is a famous comedian named Bill Cosby. Oh. Okay. Now, the reason why I had to get this is because you ever, you ever know sometimes you're in a certain scenario in life, you're just not getting your way, and you're like, man, I could really, really get this guy's attention. The, these bottles will come in handy because in each of these bottles, there's a, there's a little there's a little pill inside that you can make them do whatever you want. You want them to go to sleep, you get the blue one. You want them to get all energetic for you, you pick the green one. This you sounds want them morally to... questionable. Don't worry about it, it's fine. <laughs> They'll cause it, it's okay. That takes like a luck, by the way. Oh, man. Don't worry about it. Not getting your way. Each bottle comes in handy for any social scenario. Oh my god! It, it works perfectly fine. Okay, uh, that sounds questionable indeed. All right, All right. I ha I have a very special artifact for you. I don't know if you guys knew this, but I am in fact an expert on uh, mushroom societies, and by oh. sheer random chance, I have stumbled upon Florbenhagen, the petrified. Ooh. The petrified remains of a mycelium prince. Legends say that waking him from his magical slumber will grant one wish. How do you do that? It's magic, Jack. That's how well, magic no, works. I know it's magic, but I'm saying, what's the method to... I don't know. You're going to have to figure that out on your own. Uh, the cup <laughs> is just an ordinary cup. It is included free of charge. How do you know he grants the wish, then? Thank you! It's been <laughs> tested! Okay. The seven mushroom bowls have come together. By the way, Darian, what the fuck? That was a comfortable. That was like. <laughs> Damn. For each pair. Says the man trying to sell us Satan. Well, he's not gonna. He's not gonna like. Okay, he might. Shit. Uh, <laughs> if you ask him to, he will. Uh. Yeah. You could tell I was getting tongue-tied during that whole thing because I'm trying to sell you on fucking. <laughs> I'm trying to sell you on date rape. Zip zap zoom yeah, pop pill. Like, what were the other two items, by the way? What were, if that was the best choice, what were the other two items? I don't even remember uh, what mine were. I think I had a doll or something. I got the cheapest of the three. Yeah, I picked the cheapest. The person selling clearly oh. did not know the value of Florbin Hog and the Petrified. Well, shit, I, I, I picked the most expensive. Mine was cheap because it's eco-friendly. I'm the only one who's, like, going all out and, like, not trying to sell, like, some some fucked up, like, uh, hentai pills. They I let mean... you do whatever you want. <laughs> You're selling Satan as a slave, Jack! <laughs> he deserves it! <laughs> He's lied. Look, I'm just trying to make it to where Finish people can... Finish your votes. Can... Five seconds. Three, two, one. Vote, 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 vote. Uh -huh. Who didn't vote? The final value is... $2,000 for Satan. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I'm, I'm cool with that. He looks sad. I, I made a profit. <laughs> oh. It's eco-friendly. I'd be a bad person not to like it. You don't want Pill Cosby's Finest. It's a good selection. Oh. 
It's a, it's a good selection. For it. <laughs> well, you made a profit. Yeah. Uh, Not bad, Zoran. That was pretty nice. Good. I was the one who voted for that, uh, by the way. That seemed to. Uh... I also voted for the, the uh, eco friendly GPS. Sandy, not far behind. Okay, ne next time, let's not let's do something that's let's sell stuff that's not uh, morally questionable. <laughs> Jack, <laughs> Satan. I'm the, no, me too. I'm it's for my song or complete trash for. What's wrong with some dark humor? <laughs> yeah. Fuck Bill Cosby, by the way. <laughs> Okay, cool. Take this. Shopping's done. Get your card punched on the way out. After ten items, they give you another card. A third card. This game's all right. I you think this is better or worse than that investor uh, other presentation games? There's I, there's a little less creative potential in this one. Yeah, I don't love having to present my own thing, but uh, it's fine. That's lame. That is really, really lame. Yeah. That's gonna ruin the whole thing. Oh. Make a typo. That is going to. No, I didn't make a typo. Uh, this didn't happen on the last round for some reason. It's always something. It's the orientation glitch. of the phone. It it will not let me click the bottom thing that lets you write whatever you want. Uh. Oh, did you? Uh, did you? Did you try? Uh... <clears throat> Something I did. Uh, I, uh. Can you zoom? I oh, no, I can. Oh, yeah, you can flip the phone over and hold it. Okay, I just. Never mind, I got it. Yeah. And also, you well, can it, lock it, 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 it won't be my first answer, so. Oh, man. All right, let me see. I think I, I, I can save this. Three. Five seconds. Two. two well, one. now I can't. <laughs> God. Sorry. I think I could just save with my words, though. I think I got it. Yeah, you can just not show that one on screen. Yeah, you can just. Just use the power of a uh... creepy curios. 
I need to let the time run down. All right, All right I'm first this time. I have for you a rare, one of a kind artifact. Behold, oh, the that original Frederick Leopold Fazbear the First. Ah, right. Ooh. Though not widely known, the popular character Freddy Fazbear was in fact born at Build a Bear Workshop. The one that you are familiar with is in fact Freddy Fazbear the Second. This rare first edition creation went on to inspire one of the most beloved children's characters of all time. And one of a kind, this is the one. This is the, this is the one that was made that inspired it. You can buy it yourself and own it. It's a piece of history. Will he also move around to try to kill you? No, this one is just a bear. This one is oh, just okay. a teddy bear. It's just a bear. Oh, yeah. Cool. All right. That actually seems sweet and cuddly. Oh, here's some facts. I like it. Fact sheet. Oh, uh, you're up, Sandy. That would be me. All right, let's do it. All right. Tell me about your item. All right. Um, <laughs> like a catheter bag. That's a colostomy bag. <laughs> guys, guys, you can't just assume what this is, okay? Actually, this is going to be a state-of-the-art fish transporter. <laughs> um, now, what what you do? Now, don't don't be put off by the name, right? This is actually something you take hiking with you. You fill it up with distilled water and a fish. What okay. you do is you drink from it, and every once in a while, you'll get a nice protein-filled treat when you sip on it. Um, so you can get your omegas, and you can get rehydrated if you happen to inhale the fish while you're sipping. If if. <laughs> Oh, does the it's fish... the snack that what does the fish flavor the water <laughs> no it's the snack that smells back a pack of protein so you don't even need the little cheesy ones anymore this is literally the future will this be coming to i am fish in the form of dlc no this is the base content okay i'm done you can uh, yeah so enjoy a tasty omega treat with your water okay i'm done all right yeah. Okay, you guys hungry? Hungry for apples? Well, no, I just uh, drank a fish, thanks. Not apples. Okay, <laughs> well, it, too bad because here's my item. This, you, what does this look like to you? Uh, ham. yeah, ham. Yeah, okay, it's not ham though. It is actually track and flank steak. Okay. <laughs> I call it bullshit, I would know. No, 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 no. You don't Jack understand. Sandy is very offended. <laughs> okay, no, Sandy. I, I thought about this because it's not what you think. We didn't, we didn't like take like living sapient dragons and like murdered them for their uh, for their ass meat. Okay, it's ethically sourced from non sentient dragons. So it's, we're basically like hunting cows and shit. It's like it's like it's like monkeys to compare to humans. And uh, but the best part, and you, and you, I think you'll be uh, interested in this, Sandy, is that. Uh, Eating one will turn you into a dragon over time, over time, like a smart one, not like a like dumb cow dragon. And it's very nutritious. Uh, it's delicious. You cook it with like with like salt and stuff. It'll taste better than any kind of like a cow meat ever. How high uh, do I have to set my same. oven to cook it? Uh, dragons uh, don't burn, Jack. Degrees. <laughs> I Actually, think no, I think my oven can do that. This is Shark Tank. This is, this is getting a down vote. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is not. This is Shark Tank. All right, for the other two people that aren't offended. All right, all right Darian's all right. up. Okay, here we go. Are, are we so gonna... this one, I knew for a fact I had to get this, not just because it was a great piece to pick up, but because there's some truth to this that I need to expose. All right. So what I have here is a painting. Is a painting from the Titanic. Not just any painting either. I'm sure you guys have watched James Cameron's Titanic movie, right? In which the scene in which we see Jack Dawson do that painting of Rose with her on the couch, right? Well, the thing about this is that historians will have you believe that Jack Dawson painted a nude woman. It was in fact not. The thing about this is that Jack's actual art style was so bad that James Cameron had to make artistic liberties and make him a good artist to save the movie. They have Hollywood the is, this is the real painting. This is it. This is as good as it's gonna look. So if you now, want a piece a of real history, take this home with you and put it on your wall. <laughs> Thank you. How do you fuck up the hair color at least? Come on! You're not paying for the art, you're paying for the historical authenticity. It's yes. not authentic if the hair is blue! <laughs> Dude, you're gonna kill me! I don't know why I'm George Lucas this stream. <laughs> Oh my god. 
Oh my god. <laughs> uh. <laughs> just the mental image of, what, what like, like, of like that scene that? where he's just painting him, but he's just finger painting this. Paint me like <laughs> one of your kindergarten girls. <laughs> god damn. You, you can't even I'm tell if die. she's actually naked. <laughs> The heart of the ocean, let's go. She's not even wearing the heart of the ocean. It's Who's not picking? I, I voted. I voted. Did you vote three times? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So this is third hand so meat you're selling. All of the uh, me? No. No, I, uh... To see what these toilet puppies are worth. Disagree. No, I, no, it's a farming thing. Frederick Leopold Fazbear. All right, what's my profit on this fucked up teddy bear? Lone Star. Mm, nice. Oh, that's pretty good. That's an okay profit, I guess. I think it was average. Oh, I got one vote. It's you just put fish in a bag of water and drinking from it. That's not worth it. <laughs> Sorry. Animal cruelty. <laughs> okay, Jack. Well, at least it's better than yours. Oh, no, it's okay. okay. He uses dumb dragons. Do you use dumb fish? There's no such thing as a dumb dragon except for Nibs. Nice. Yeah. I knew y'all would like a piece of history. <laughs> Stop it, you're gonna literally kill me. It's a stone, Luigi. You didn't make it. Well, that just created a demand. Well, it's not that big a lead. I mean, it's $4,000 for me. <clears throat> it's time for one last shot to win. You're gonna quickly give your new collection of items an overall name. What oh. ties these trashy treasures to? Oh, hey. F nothing. Up a name for the set now. I didn't know we were supposed to be matching. No, uh, now we are. Jokes on you. I'm happy to be a frog. Okay. Yeah, maybe I could turn this around. Hmm. And those pills were what uh, Jack was on when he was making that. <laughs> <laughs> also, to be <laughs> fair, I chose the mystery item. I didn't know it was going to be a catheter. Yeah, well, that, that's that's on you then, huh? No. You just you just you're you just literally chose two pieces of trash. They're all trash. No, my my Satan, Satan, Satan uh, butler is 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 very cool and, and does whatever I want it to. And the dragon meat is very delicious, and I will eventually become a dragon like my idol Sarkon Vol. Now, if you paired Satan with the pills, you'd have a set. <laughs> oh yeah, that. All right. Why are Zellrocks always cursed? The <laughs> ultimate travel kit. Dinner service. <laughs> Yum meat, sir. Vote for the set you like best. I, I think I trust the dragon meat less if Satan's bringing it to me. <laughs> the dragon <laughs> meat is ethically <laughs> sourced, I promise. <laughs> He doesn't look like Satan, he looks like uh, that cover from Baby on Baby 2. He looks like Waluigi. He looks like Scrooge. Okay, yeah, th I, I will say Wah, that's, that's fair enough. Let me see which lucky duck will no longer be a frog, but a human. Sandy's stuff, to be fair, it all, it all goes together, so that that's how it works. Oh. Hey, good job! You're here, trash. It doesn't go together for shit, it just... How I named it. It's just two pieces of trash. It, it, it goes together. <laughs> I'm wow. sorry if you... Alright, next it's game. It's Darian Minmax. He had one great one and, and one awful one. Yeah. Jack, yeah. Jack was a savage. Sandy had, the, Sandy had the clever name for his pair. Just... My Satan meat didn't work out well. Not sensory. Jack, that wasn't dragon meat. I can, I know this. Oh, we got a, like a 90s <laughs> I know, CG I, but I monkey. picked it, and I thought I could sell it as that, but... In I dragon, I... in the world of dragons, I'm the village bicycle, okay? Oh, so he admits that it wasn't actually dragon meat. I thought I could sell it We're as it. We're not playing the game anymore, alright? Alright. 
I'm just messing with you, Jared. I know. Oh, I didn't. Ah, shoot, I didn't see it. Here. I was too. Oh, here we go. What's this one called? Oh, non sensory? Yeah. Again, going into these completely blind. I have no idea what any of these games are. Yeah. Okay, so this is the drawing one, apparently. Oh, is it? Yeah, that's what it says. Is it? Hello, I'm Professor Nanners. Thank you for participating in this study, unlocking your powers of non-sensory perception. Okay, so we're gonna be psychics. Cool. College student's first blender project. <laughs> Test one. Writing. Everyone will begin with a similar writing task. Oh, I'm the pear-shaped light category. bulb. Make up a restaurant name. The rest okay. of the information about what you'll write and where your secret number sits on the range should be on your device now. Try to write an answer that will lead your fellow participants towards guessing your secret number, or just write an answer that okay. makes sense Okay, so this is a game about guessing numbers. Guide you. Okay, uh... This game is explaining nothing. I love it. Okay. Well, it seems like we're probably going to get multiple prompts to try to get people to guess our number. Yeah. Based off of words, this is this is a very interesting concept. Let's see if it pays off. Please note that you're halfway through your time. Forty-five seconds. Thirty seconds. We'll begin with this. How many stars does this ice cream parlor get in reviews? And this participant's answer. Robert Finley's squeeze a cow. Hmm. Use your device Shit. to hone in on their secret number. I wouldn't go there. That sounds is it possible his secret number is one? Use your device to share your emotional feedback. Yeah, I think, I think. Then that, you, you know, you know it's fresh though. <laughs> True. And they pro they don't use dragons. <laughs> like that scene in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory where they go to find the whipped cream factory, and it's just a bunch of people whipping cows. It's self-explanatory. I'm measuring your mind that's fair enough by how close you got to the secret number that, that sounds like a two and a half star uh we got it just Bonus right success is here damn I the writer gets points for every player that got close Let's oh. okay and this is this game is dope Same question but now it's this all right answer. so what is Jack's ice cream parlor old con creamery Oh man! I, I, I bet miss, people would would. I thought it was between like two, so I, I uh, yeah. I, I bet people would be eager to support like a felon trying to t trying to reform. Some people. It took me a while to get how this game was played, but I got it now. I think so. I'll do better next round. Add confidence. Mm -hmm. Where does the truth lie? Oh! Yeah, I, I, I fucked that one up pretty mm. badly. One of you was honing in a bit. Only one. Oh, it shows who's yeah. plugged where. Yeah. Okay, new question. How many minutes would you have to wait to get a table at this restaurant? Let's see the response. Shay Wario! <laughs> This one's going from 10 to 100. Hmm. Ooh. Everyone Shea wants named... to eat the Wario's. Okay, Che means that that it'd probably be like you'd wait longer, but the fact that it's Wario's means that it's pro you probably wouldn't want to get a table there anyway. Okay, but Wario's real. You can go to his restaurant and meet him. And get a plate full of garlic. Wow! While you're at it. <laughs> Let's try that. 
So then again, or just some wrong. dude dressed as Wario. He probably eats the food before it gets to the table, so you have to wait longer. Wow, well, uh, half orders only. Ten. <laughs> Mix. Oh! 40. <laughs> yeah, I knew it! I you miraculously it. got it exactly <laughs> right. As a group. Continuing with the same question. Alright, what's this one? Response. Um, the, the Roaring, roaring Twenties. Would probably be reasonably popular, right? It pro it'd be reason it might be reasonably popular, or it could be Darian uh, giving us an, a clue. What do you think we knew? But what's correct? That feels cheaty, if so. Good job, Darian! You did it! <laughs> I might have misinterpreted the question. <laughs> the, no, they call it the Aurora Twenties because you get your meal in twenty minutes or less, or your or your money back. Or your money back. Okay. That that sounds that sounds like an exploit in this game. Yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> I mean, I didn't call for huh? it. No. All right, uh, draw full rule. We're not gonna do we're not gonna do numbers to betray uh, it. No writing numbers in prompts. Yeah. Unless it's like over or under, like an unrelated number. Two. Drawing. Well, the reason why I wrote Drawing. that is because it said, "Oh, name a restaurant where it'd be likely that it would take 20 minutes to uh, get it." So I was like, "Oh, oh, That's we're gonna right. draw a clown now." Okay, now we're drawing. Something with your intuition. Uh, here comes the drawing. Oh, we got no time for this. We got 60 minutes. It's, it's 60 seconds. It's fine. Yeah, I think that's good enough. Ten seconds, everyone. <clears throat> Eight, seven, six, five, four, hit, hit, submit. Whatever you got, Darian. Hit, submit. Two, Darian, hit, submit. one. Hit, submit. Take it. <laughs> <laughs> that, we need God. longer for drawing prompts. Yeah. Jesus. Had to really come in clutch with that. And hold the confidence button to get bonus points for I don't. Close. I don't know if I'll ever hit the confidence but button. If you're more than one spot <laughs> off, you'll lose points instead. Yeah, no okay. thanks. Let's begin no thanks. with this question. How likely is this clown to get accidentally hurt? Let's see okay. the response. Alright, let's see. It is a clown. This one uses it also may be a dog or dragon. Hard to tell. Sandy, you're oh, not allowed to talk. Oh, he's Wait. got a boulder on his head. Does that's, he? That's high. I assume that was his clown afro. Yeah. Kind of looks like he's got like Chinese dragon whiskers. I don't know. It just looks like a clown what to me. Oh, nice. really? Okay, so I guess he's just a standard, ordinary clown. How the hell do you draw a clown that's likely to get hurt? I don't know. Draw a bruise on it. Bloody nose. A clown with a shiny black eye. <laughs> Same question. How likely is this clown to get accidentally hurt? Does he have a... <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I stand corrected. <laughs> He's just testing out the cannon. Someone's got to do maintenance. <laughs> it will work! That's, a, that's good. That's... It's a confetti cannon! 
Yeah. <laughs> How do you do 40% though? What's 40%? Like, it's either not at all or extremely likely. Wait, There's no in between. Oh, uh, he's drunk. Yeah, that, that would be pretty tricky. Clown is like, is like uh, alcoholic. I, could, I should have drawn a drunk clown. Alright, how wealthy is this clown? He's got I'm a going hobo to sack, so uh, that's a little yeah. telling. <laughs> it has a rucksack. So. They're good. I think I did. I think I sold it too hard, honestly. With the cannon? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I could have. I oh, could have been like, he could have just been staring at bills. Yeah. Close together. That could be good. The truth, however, it's gonna be, oh, three. be about three. It's gonna be. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't really get poorer than that. Yeah. What would he just be looking at bills, or just him getting evicted from his house? <laughs> Just like sitting in a rundown apartment watching yeah. TV with a beer belly. That's <laughs> that's, the, that's the cum face. That's that's a seven to me. What what's the Yamanoka or or whatever? <laughs> yeah, that one. I know which one you're talking about. The, it's a uh, series of faces. Oh, the purr face, the Yowie purr face. He kind of looks like uh, he 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 kind of looks like. Uh, like the James Bond character, the band one, the short one. Yeah, hey, Zelrog, you want to pick an answer? Yeah. <laughs> if I had, yeah, if I had more time, I would have given him a cigar. Nah, see. Odd job. He looks like Odd Job. Odd yeah. Job, yeah. <laughs> Which is also a great name for a clown, by the way. Ah, okay, uh, there you go. That makes so much sense. God damn it. He's he's not he's not really like he doesn't have a monocle. He just looks like a clown. He's like average clown. All right. That's a wrap. <laughs> Businessman two. clown. Larry the clown. <laughs> All right, then. In yeah. the interest of Working class clown. What I've learned so far. He's not the class clown. He's the working class clown. Oh, I have but no such ability. Translation software has a lovely voice, don't you think? All right, round three. We are now entering the final test. Oh, this is quick. Are we going to end the game and it will say zero tests without a fart incident? It's time Maybe. to draw a combination of two very. What if it kept track? Things. What if it? What if it changed when someone writes oh, fart in a prompt? Okay. Oh my god. Okay. How, how am I going to do this? Uh. By the way, you're halfway through your time. Between two points. I'm sure this game would be a lot better with, like, more people. Yeah. Yeah, this seems like one of those games that's just, like, get everybody together and then play. Let's play some, uh... Nonsense. 40 seconds, by the way. Sorry, uh, 25 seconds. 25 seconds. Yeah, uh... 20 seconds! Be able to finish this and then uh, go feed the time is up. Come on. Oh, time's up. Just Five it, seconds. Yeah. We'll begin with this. <laughs> Where does this drawing belong between? <laughs> I saw this problem like, what the, the fuck? <laughs> okay. Does anyone have a fire mullet? Sweet tooth isn't really a mullet. <laughs> no, this is closer to mullet. Yeah, I know who has a fire mullet. I don't know. It looks like a dog. It doesn't look like either a fire or a mullet. Unless, I guess it's the back of someone's head, and it's it's smoking yeah. a little bit, so, uh... Let's say 90% mullet. That's my, my vote. It looks like a smoking Candy, mullet. Candy, five seconds. Please. Thank you. It doesn't look at all like fire, so I don't expect anybody to go past... Are you serious?! Uh, true answer. 
Thank you, Zelrog. You're you're the one who actually thought about this shit. Well, hey, it still looks hey. like a dog. Yeah. It's a switch controller. A switch controller? No, it's that's not it. Oh, it How fucked up is your switch controller? It looks like a dog. Thank you. That's just totally a mullet. Where's Zelrog. the fire? That is 100% mullet. I, I'm gonna say. Zorog, uh, how, how fire do you think that mullet is? I don't, it, it, how fire does Darien think my mullet is? You picked. Yeah. Like what I'm seeing so far, but where? It's gonna be 100% fire, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate the sentiment. Because <laughs> it's fire. Yeah, I'm, I was being literal. Between hamster and <laughs> this game is shots. nonsense. I love it. I should have drawn like a minivan inside a hamster ball. Oh, what so are those hamsters closer cars, to the uh, center then, isn't it? Well, that one is pretty clearly just a hamster. This is Sandy's drawing. Oh, yeah. Those little hamster cars. The Kia Souls. Yeah, those cars. Is it ever 100% though? It can be. They don't... Uh... Like, because then you only have one chance to be close, not two chances. These All playing it safe. Consensus. How close were we? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> First 100% one, and there, there, there we go. We only got. No one hit it perfectly, but you were all close. Continuing with the same. Question. All right, what's Zelrog's monstrosity gonna look like? That's actually wow. not bad. That'd be a good 60%. It's probably closer to minivan than hamster. Yeah. Just a... I'm gonna go 70, actually. Are the accessories real, or are they fake? Uh, this is, reminds me of that uh, one uh, famous uh, furry, like, uh, drawing where it's like, not furry, furry, dangerously furry, dangerously cheesy. How furry is it? I figure it's like one of the, like, people, those people who put reindeer stuff on oh, their wow. car. Oh, <laughs> wow. Yeah, okay, that's 80%. What would 90% be, then? Would it just be, like, a, like a hamster sitting on top of the... Of the minivan? It, it had like a hamster hula doll. The final okay, yeah, that, that would actually make a lot more sense. I like that game. I like this game. This game is actually... Yeah, I felt like it would be one of those, like, oh dumb, God. like, uh, trivia number games, but this actually is, like, pretty clever. There haven't been any really bad ones in this, which means we're no. due for the fifth one. Uh, Maybe this oh, one is the it. one where they nail all of it. This is a short game, which means that you could do two rounds in a, in a row if you wanted, but yeah. uh, let's move on to the next one. I like this game. They've all been pretty good so far. I, I take it back. Right. Boomerang sucked. <laughs> hey, uh, the other two, did Boomerang, did Boomerang suck? Play Quick forever? Start. No, thank you. Let's see how many rounds you can survive. What does that mean? Team okay. Cat and Team Dog. Well, this one's trivia. Oh, is it? Awesome. Is oh. this? I don't. I don't like trivia. Come on. Let's fibbage though. <laughs> that that is a room code. <laughs> Enut. Team Dog. Got a bunch of Mega Man enemies here. Hold on, I gotta get in. I'm gonna be UFO Kirby. Yep. Hi, I'm a box. The dynamic duo. We're gonna. I argue am the black so hard, I bet. I I am forced to team dog, even though I'm a cat person. Forced. <laughs> These blocks aren't going to sort themselves. Born to cat, forced to dog. It's quick sorting time. Quick sort. Round one. Fox Ghost was one of the few ca Danny Phantom characters to canonically reproduce. What? Ghosts yeah, can fuck, apparently. 
Did not know that. He had a daughter from the oh, future. Wait. It takes place. It it takes place in the in the Bleach universe. Yeah. Cool. All right, choose a prompt for Danny Phantom. Actually, a Soul Reaper. Okay, so they're voting for. Uh, Arian, what do you want? I, I don't know what it's asking you. Let's it's a prompt. A well, I know that, but... All right, so they got to sort uh, from the shortest... Oh, celebrity, celebrity heights. Short. Tom Cruise. Very tall. <laughs> oh, I see. Uh, oh, Bo Burnham. I don't know. Average? How big is Bo Burnham? <laughs> Average oh. for a man, I guess. I assume. I don't know. I'll just put him right here. Tetris! Let's go. Alright, Darian. Who? Daniel oh, oh, that's he's a Harry a short Potter. Dude. Yeah, it's Harry Potter. He's a short he's a shorty. Daniel Radcliffe. I think he's I think I I, I thought I remembered him being pretty short. Uh, actually, yeah, I think I remember him being yeah. yeah. Why am I helping the enemy team? I should How stop. many are you gonna <laughs> have, I wonder? Do you need all the room on the treadmill? Morgan, Morgan Freeman. Freeman. Morgan Freeman. Ah, uh, Morgan Freeman. Shorter than Bo Burnham. Is where Sandy is currently. I don't know if that's true. Shorter than Bo Burnham, but taller than Daniel Radcliffe. <laughs> okay. I have no idea who that I is. I don't even know who this is. Simone Biles. I'm just gonna play it safe Simone and just... Simone Biles. American gymnast. Oh. Well, yeah, it's pretty short. <laughs> yeah! Mm. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I wonder. Wait, is he tall, Darian, or short? I don't know. <laughs> Sandy, <laughs> help me out here. I don't know. I mean, last time I saw him, he are y'all for like... real? <laughs> Did Bo Burnham? I don't know. Last time Bo I saw Burnham him. is now canonically taller than Shaq. Nice. In the fourth seat canon, and Adele is taller being... than all of Sandy. them. Sandy, Sandy, I thought you were being coy with me. <laughs> you weren't oh, helping. <laughs> Come Adele on, is taller than Shaquille O'Neal! <laughs> Stop it! Please don't kill me! Kevin Hart! <laughs> yes, Kevin Hart. <laughs> Stop Let, it! Okay, actually, Sandy, I know how tall Kevin Hart is. Kevin Hart You're is at least, like, six feet. Shorter than Shaq. Shorter than Daniel Radcliffe, Se Simone Danny, Biles, and Adele. Danny DeVito, oh, there He's we go. He's a giant. Yeah, make him short. I know how short he is. <laughs> Danny DeVito is just on the cusp of legal dwarfism. <laughs> and he's four foot I'm the something. Trash oh, man. Kardashian. <laughs> That's how her name is spelled. Huh. <laughs> Wait a minute, they're all shorter than Shaq? They're all shorter than Bo? Always have been. Oh, this game's hilarious. Alright. I'm so glad the two people who didn't know how tall Shaq was were on a team. No, I know how tall Shaq is. I don't know why. <laughs> oh, I thought for sure Sandy would have got that. I didn't. I didn't. I thought you were playing with me. I thought you, you were joking with me, Sandy. Too busy laughing. Oh, Burnham is six five. I don't watch basketball. But like it, like cultural osmosis though. We all know that Shaq is like the tallest dude around. He's a giant dude on hot wings. There's YouTube videos of Shaq using normal size like, objects. He's in commercials everywhere nowadays too. He was in a commercial with his wife and her tiny shoes by comparison. Oh, all right. Yeah. Uh, most popular to least popular. I think we can do that. Uh, sure. I'm a hipster. I'm in charge of keeping track of what's popular so I can hate on it. I know a lot of that instead of tall and short. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get, like, Cactus and... You do Hakusho, that's one of the popular animes these days, right? That's what the kids are watching? I was hoping they'd be, like, inanimate. Oh, I have to vote. Uh, yeah, vote, please. Thank you. So, you're sorting most popular plushies. Oh, uh, fuck off. This would have been my type. Is Frederick the first on here? All right, let's see. Plushies. All right, am I up? Okay. Bears. Bears? Just, pretty just popular. bears? Yeah. Just teddy bears. Right. Don't put it at the very end, but pretty far. Something like this that, yeah. Good. All right, lock it in. All right, bear plushie, pretty popular. Dra uh, <laughs> oh, no, Sandy. Uh, They're probably not that. I'm going to say, like, here. Mark. What do you think, Jack? I'll just yeah. own you if you put it there, Zarog. Do it, put it there. There we go. And I'm not selling their meat, Sandy. 
You unicorns. Put unicorns are very popular. Oh, yeah. Maybe more than bear. I don't know if more than bears, maybe a little bit. Yeah, this, will, this sounds about right. Uh... Bunnies. Uh, Slightly average. under bears. Right? Yeah. Probably a little bit more, but... Squeeze in, just so we have... Just so we're covered. Yeah. I don't know if they do, like... Uh... I'm a school bus driver. I know what the kids have. Pandas. <laughs> Fuck no. Between dragons and bunnies? Do you think there are more dragons than pandas? I think there are less uh, pandas than dragons. Okay. People like dragons more than pandas. Poor panda. What if he's up yeah. to? Cats. C yes. More than bunnies, yeah. do you think? Cats yeah, or bunnies? Yeah, more than bunnies. Probably more than bears, honestly. Wait, no. No, probably more than bunnies, but not... More uh... than bunnies. I'm just gonna mess it up. I can't help but say it. But how popular are right. shack plushies? Elephants? elephants. No. Nope. <laughs> They're not popular. Oh, no. Fuck Anybody elephants, am I right? Elephants. We better hope we don't get one worse than elephants, or we're not gonna be able to put it. Yaks. <laughs> yeah. Jack. No, you yaks. Jack, yeah, you fucked us. Is a yak. No, no, no. You can go a little bit over. Oh, okay. Can I? Over. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Yaks less than elephants. A well, uh, there is Yona. Yak. Remember Heffalump the movie with We Need a Blue and Piglet. That's a Heffalump, not a yak. Silly. No, Sandy. It's, an, it's an elephant. Though. Snowmen. Snowmen. Okay, that's they're actually seasonal. Pretty... Yeah. I think more well, than dry between dragon and bunny. Yeah, here then. I think that's it. Yep, cool. We've sorted them all. Let's see your score. I can't wait to see how badly we fucked up. Where are they getting these numbers from? Did they pull a hundred people? Yeah, one hundred Oh, oh a lot wow, of elephants. Okay. Snowman's oh. not as popular. Yeah, bunny cat bear. And Unicorn, apparently, is... Oh, wow, okay. Yeah. No one... Okay, That's no elephants was point. up there. Pretty good. We did all right. Uh-oh. We're not too far behind. Round two. Let's do it. No, it's pretty close. This is going to be one of those games where only the last round matters. <laughs> Probably. Uh, like do you guys want to make this the last game, or do you want to do something after this? Finish it off. I mean, I'm down. down. I think we can do another round of Rumerang. Or we could do a drawing game like TKO or something. Or we can well if we want to do draw game we can do uh, we can do uh, extra sensory again or non sensory rather. You want a vote, Terry? Uh, let's see here. Are you gonna guess when people were born, or do you want a different right. random prompt? prompt. Let's get I'm gonna go a different prompt. I always get the human based ones. It's... Compared it. Oh, okay. This should be interesting. I know this. One, so this, this is funny. just this is just math. Yeah, but to how do you well you know a tech stuff, trash. or you can like a oh that's why they savvy. man I wish I got this. There's trash blocks. It's Tetris. I'm the trash man. One bite. I mean, it doesn't get any smaller than that. Yeah, a bite yeah, is the smallest. Technically, it does, but no, don't, don't step. There it. Yeah, okay. Wait, I, I don't want to put the trash. Better hope you don't get a bit or a nibble. <laughs> a nibble. That the, a nibble is half oh, a bite. Oh, terabyte. A terabyte is one thousand twenty-four gigabytes. So we'll put it probably like right here for now. Yeah, I said like the middle's good. Not a bite. I've never even heard of a not a bite. It's that it's not goes... a bite. Closer to the right, yeah. I figured it would be. Or no, I don't even. Or it doesn't even exist. I think that's a fake. <laughs> that's fake. That's fake. Yada bite. Okay, yada bite is. Bin yacht, please. It's it's one from a zeta bite. So let's go here. Oh, it's real. Yada yada yada. yada. Real. Yeah, yada. yada uh, right now, not real. a bite is fake though. That should have gone in the trash. A bit. Oh. You wanna know what's smaller than a bite? <laughs> you done fucked up. I guess you can do that. You blocked off your yep. uh, your compactor. Well, the left one, not the right one. A bit is bigger than a bite. Big a bite. No, a bite, bite is eight bits. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay. <laughs> no, Sandy, what are you doing? Terabyte. Sandy. Terabytes, a Get thousand gigabytes. Stupid. Terabytes. I fucked up. Uh, zero byte. It's okay. It's okay. It's one mistake. Oh yeah, zero byte. Totally use those all the time. Yet you get to them yet. Darian, what are you doing? <laughs> it won't fucking load half the time. And a not a byte. Kill a byte. I feel sorry for anyone who is like playing with grandma and gets this prompt. <laughs> this is why this is a team game. Darian, play this game with your parents. They would be so lost on this. They probably would. Exabyte. Can you not move, Darian? They, they'd want to do all the trivia games. Can you or, not move at all? No, I can move. It's just that sometimes that, when it switches goes... between rounds, sometimes it just chooses to load and other times it doesn't. Oh, that sucks. I have to keep reloading the goddamn page. Exabyte. A brownie bite. Brownie bite. I love a bite of brownie. A brownie bite. <laughs> That's blocked off. You can't go to that side. Oh, shit. No! <laughs> My favorite bites: a brownie bite, a zero bite, and a not a bite. <laughs> well, the little one. Peta bite. Peta, peta bite. And that goes to the right. That goes to the right. I, I okay. No, it goes below yada bite. I'm sorry. After We're, it's easy to be mean in this game. I don't mean to. Well, I mean you're being mean. It, it's a trivia game. game. Yeah. Zeta bite. It's right. Yeah, zeta bite goes right before yada bite. But I fucked up and put a gigabyte there. See, I didn't know those two. I can't yeah, remember. Right. How bad we do? Let's see how you did. Yeah, I, I fucked up a couple times. A brownie bite doesn't even. Okay, we, we we at least got those right. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, brownie bite. Yeah, terabyte, nice. You know what? I don't, I don't need this. You can play oh, four it closes the distance. And brings them closer to the spot. We got three. All right, pretty good. I wish I didn't fuck that one up. Yeah, we could have had four. If... I, I forgot that I was putting it above terabyte. Oh. Okay. Well. First, First letter to last letter or mystery prompt. I, uh, letters. I don't. How, I don't how could that history. be hard? Okay, let's do it. Hmm. You will fear the trivia prowess of the box ghost! <laughs> oh shit, I don't know this at all. Okay, oh, I know this freeze. a little bit. That's how they get we, you. we could no, look it up, we could cheat. <laughs> okay. What, do you think Epsilon you're gonna be doing with five. alphabet? Epsilon. Okay. Epsilon is the fifth letter. Wait, you actually know this? I do. Oh, Alpha, please. Beta, Gamma, Delta, Epsilon. Alpha. Alpha. Number as, one. As far left as you can. Nothing before Alpha. Oh, okay. Yeah. There's a bit of delay on my end, but... Delta, that's the fourth one. Beta. Okay, so before Epsilon. There you go. Do that. You're giving us the easy ones. Chamda. That Chamda is fake. There's a lambda. Yeah, there's a shamda. I can't wait for shamda to come out. Do you think that's gonna be one? All right. Omega is the last that's one. That's the last one. Everybody knows that. Yeah. I won't cover the trash. No, though. don't, don't, don't. Yeah, yeah, we need, we need to dispose of them. Cause that'll break our combos. The Omega. Lambda. I don't remember exactly. It's somewhere in the middle. Okay, so it's just put it in the middle. Okay, yeah. Where's the lambda sauce? <laughs> Cha chi chai? Chi chi. That's fake. Okay. There's a pie, there's a phi. Good chi. Good chi. Next one is. No, Waka, waka is not waka. a letter. <laughs> waka Waka. Hey, Kermit, did you know I'm in the Greek alphabet? <laughs> That's not uh, true, Fozzy! Pi. Pi. I believe is after Lambda. Okay. Pi is after Lambda. Uh, this is a guess. I'm not totally positive. 
we ready for some beta shit? Theta, theta. is probably theta. between ph pi and omega. Maybe, actually, no, I'm not sure. Okay. Let's uh, try that, yeah, just right after pi. We'll nail the first five, and that'll be good enough points. Sigma, Sigma balls! <laughs> Where's that? Uh, yeah, there. Sigma. Everyone's favorite Mega Man villain. <laughs> He's the fifth, uh, ever Come on. Whoosh. Whoosh. Also, beta didn't even uh, didn't even come up. They just skipped uh, that one. And gamma. Pi. No, we got pi. We didn't get phi. I hope we get them. All. Do you think we got them all right? <clears throat> Correct. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh. Nice. Was theta earlier. It was. Uh, we swept theta and sigma. Omega. Oh, there oh, is a chai. Chi. Damn. We got five. Oh. Yeah, well, we did we did better than... First round. round oh, there's four rounds. Then came round two. And now, surprise, surprise, it's round three. In this round, I'm giving you two chances to sort this sequence correctly. Good luck. Two chances. All right. All right, what do we want? We got... Darian's character to looks a like ball. a Steven Universe something or other. First yeah, style. style. Do I choose a mystery prompt? I don't think... I don't know about animals either, so I wouldn't want to... I'm probably going to go with... Yeah, I'm going to go mystery yes, prompt. The elusive mystery prompt. Let's tackle... Sauces by Invention Date. Invention Date. Okay, this, this might be good. Oh, I want to know this too. Yeah... Our right. guru sauce. Ranch dressing. I want to say... They I don't have really ranch dressing in Sweden. So you think it's be, I think it's like recent. Yeah, you know what? Oh, that's the most recent is on the left. Wait, no, Flubber. other way around. Flubber. Good movie. Re yeah. Most recent is on the right. Yeah. But what was Flubber. the first sauce? <laughs> Caesars. Probably. I don't know. All right. I, I don't think Yellow Julius Caesar ate Caesar dressing. Why is it an exclamation point? Yeah, Let's like... Oh, I guess they're all exclamation points. It's exciting! It's literally a seed. It had to be invented early. Yeah, so... Long. Yellow mustard, though, specifically. Like the American kind. Tabasco. Tabasco. That's gotta be older, I think. I don't know why I'm helping you. I'm sorry. <laughs> What the fuck is gray sauce? Gray sauce? What? Dude, aliens that that think fake. that exists. That's gotta be fake. Do you have more gray poop on? Gray sauce is a sauce that aliens invented. They brought with them to Area 51, but they rejected it. Oh, it's from the future! <laughs> Mayonnaise! <laughs> it's an amalgamation of every sauce on Earth. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's Bowser sauce. Gray sauce is what you turn into if you fuck with nano machines. <laughs> Queso. Queso. That's a that's technically called a sauce. I guess oh, it's, it's liquid good. cheese. Just right there. Scary. Last sauce ever invented. I agree with that. The the liquefaction of cheese was very recent. Western dressing. Is that what a is, thing? Is that a thing? I don't know. It must be. Could be. Could also be trash. I'm gonna throw it in the trash. Russians don't dress. So sorry, Russians. Uh, <laughs> actually, not sorry. Ketchup. Ketchup, that's gotta be... Ian, like, right right around they here. Invented mustard before ketchup. Tomato ketchup is recent. Well, ke ketchup yeah. was traditionally like a vinegar kind of thing. <laughs> oh, goop. You know, I, I don't fucking know. That could be a thing for all I know. What are the kids eating? <laughs> uh, I, sauce, I'm apparently. too... I'm, uh, yeah. I'm a millennial. I don't know what the fuck that is. It's disgusting what it is. Worcestershire, Worcestershire. that's gotta be, uh... Worcestershire? Probably it. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna put that, like, right there. <laughs> but did you monster, then gave the Worcestershire, then gave the catch, then gave the queso. Barbecue. Doesn't miss... exist, just trash it. 
No, it does. It has sugar in it, so I'm assuming it's going to be like right before just, ketchup. How American is this dressing? What do we got? No streaks. Nope. First sauce was barbecue. Last sauce was. Is... A second chance. Here's yours. Oh, oh barbecue sauce. So ranch dressing was the last one ever invented. Uh. Oh, Russian dressing was real. Okay. Um. They they rescued it. It's got a chip on it. Russian hasn't been around for very long. Or Russia hasn't. No, Russia's been around for years. What are That's you talking about? That's the joke, Jack. <laughs> I missed that. I guess we'll try. Try like Jesus that. has been around forever. Surely they've liquefied it. Hey, yeah. Uh, mayonnaise is, is egg mayonnaise an mayo, instrument? Mayo that really quickly, though. I wouldn't think it'd be, like, recent. If it were recent, around. it would be called Soviet dressing. Uh, yellow mustard has to be pretty old. It's... It's literally as organic as shit gets. Is it? It's just seeds. Yeah, it's just like seed extract. Like food coloring. Shit. That's what makes Ooh, it yellow. Tabasco. Or, yeah, I don't know. I feel like yellow mustard specifically is very recent, but I guess we'll see. Yeah. Worcestershire. I would put that right up here. Mayonnaise, Mayonnaise. I think, is pretty old. Ketchup. That's up. I wonder if they're counting this as the invention of red tomato ketchup or as their traditional whatever the original thing called ketchup was. Because it was very different. Yeah. Lots of technicalities here. Barbecue sauce is the okay, oldest. Okay, so that was a gimme. Oh, Yellow yeah. mustard 1904. Queso, hey, wow. First. Mayonnaise, hey, pretty old. I'm learning a lot today. What's ketchup. The they use, I guess, original ketchup. Russian dressing and... Oh, okay, so we got three. What is Russian dressing? Uh, well, no, not now. We gotta... We're up next. That one was tough. I'm gonna be honest. A piquant yeah, American salad tough. dressing, mayonnaise, ketchup, and other ingredients. The oh, fuck wow. is that Russian? No. That's Big Mac sauce. Time to pick your prompt. Earliest Early. Kevin and latest Kevin. Ooh. Kevin McAllister. Let's see the uh, Kevins. Yeah, let's see the Kevins. Fine. Let's Kevin from go. SpongeBob. Let's take a Kevin from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Famous the male Kevin's Karen. Dorks. Earliest Kevin to latest Kevin. Kevin. There could be a Kevin Bacon in there. Yeah. Yeah, totally. Uh, Kevin Bacon's. Yeah, oh, right. It's, well, I don't. When was Footloose? 80s? Uh, that was, yeah, that was like yeah, that was 80s, yeah. For early, later. Oh, okay. Well, it's not going to go far that far back. Don't put it, like, all the way to the side, though, as well. I, I won't, no. Kevin Federline marries Britney Spears. Oh, later than, later than Footloose. Probably around here. I assume that's Britney Spears. They're gonna abbreviate it yeah, just Britney. Britney. Kevin Bacon becomes another president. Kevin Bacon, huh? That's a what? movie, obviously. Was that after I, Footloose? Probably, I think right? It was before Footloose. Before? I think before, yeah. Two Kevin Bacon ones, okay. Is Bacon Bomb here? No, sorry, it's Kevin's, <laughs> not Bacon's. <laughs> Kevin, Kevin Hart, Hart is born. born. Kevin probably. Hart's like 30. Probably between Bacon and Footloose, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, think, I think you're right. He's also probably older than 30. Kevin James in Mall Cop. Oh, that's... <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's, uh, that's after Foot Footloose and after K-Fed marries Brit. You're like here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Kevin Klein. With an Oscar? Never happened. <laughs> that's a burn. What are you talking about? Oh, wait, Kevin Bacon becoming president. Shit, that was... That's... That's... Oh, that's right. Kevin Earhart. Amelia Earhart? Yeah, that was way before any of that. Well, that's not... Is that a real thing? No, okay, no, never mind. Go up. Go back. She was... She is never married. I think of Amelia Earhart, yeah. Kevin Earhart. <laughs> Kevin Bacon becomes president. That was not a... Kevin fight bandits in Home Alones. Was uh, that Kevin? He, that was after Footloose, um, around the same time. Oh, yeah, shit. that's fine. Right there. Yeah. I forgot. Kevin McAllister? Was that his name? 
Yeah, yeah from alone. Kevin Dorant drifted into NBA. Drafted in the NBA. I don't know. Um, I don't know when Kevin Durant uh, played in the NBA. Yeah, sure. Around the same time as Footloose. They're all just clumped up in the same spot. Ke no, that's not Kevin, Kevin Armstrong. Is it? Different it's, Armstrong. Uh, yeah, so that's going in the trash. Boy, it really didn't go very far back at all. It only Kevin goes as far back pretty... as our President Bacon. I mean, I guess Kevin talk, I, I, is a... Jonas, is a Jonas Brothers. Does, do they have a reality show? I, I assume. That might that might be fake. I don't know. I don't know anything about the Jonas Brothers. I know they're new-ish. Ke Kevin's a pretty modern name, isn't it? Kevin Costner in Yellowstone. Oh, that's way... That's recent. That's super that's... recent. Yeah. We'll have to use the left trash. That's not Costner. Oh, no, that was it. That's the only one. The oh, silence, geez. all you Nottinghams. We got the recent ones. Oh. Okay. Kevin James and Mall Cop. Well, we know that's, uh... That's, uh, later. That's so gotta be just... the latest one, if Yellowstone yeah. is on it. Yeah. yeah. Yellowstone? How recent was Yellowstone? That was, like, last year. Okay. Uh, Kevin Hart Kevin is Hart... born. Okay, uh, Footloose. Probably... Around the same time as Footloose. Alright, yeah. we'll put that in earliest. Not, not earliest. Let's go okay. let, leave a little room, just in case. Second yeah. from the left. That's good. Fights bandits in Home Alone. That was nineties, uh, right? Yeah, that's in between Footloose and uh, and uh, Yellowstone. Kevin Bacon is it? That's Didn't trash, happen. right? Didn't yeah. happen. I assume they were talking about, like, a movie role. I thought so, too, but then they were all talking about other movies' titles, and they didn't for this one. Kevin Federal. Okay, that's gotta be... After after uh, Home Alone, but before uh, before Yellowstone. There, no, uh, okay, that's fine. Whatever. Uh, and... Kevin Klein wins Oscar. Oh, he's So it happened? did happen. Who I don't know when it could have happened. I don't know who Kevin Klein is. I just uh, leave right there, I guess. Fuck it. I've heard of Kevin Klein. I don't recognize him from. I've heard of Kevin Klein. Kevin, Kevin Durant. That's... Durant. Uh... It sounds like an older basketball player. It, could, it might be trash. Uh, maybe it's earlier, earlier than Footloose. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, never mind. Okay. That might break the, the streak. Did you come out on top? All right, let's see. I think they might win this one. Oh yeah. I'm yeah, so mad cool. they didn't include Kevin from SpongeBob. 2007. Okay. Oh, oh, it's five. Yep. Shit, that was that was the best we've done. Kevin Durant was the one thing that screwed us over a little bit. Team? Yeah, I don't know like, sports. I don't know sport. I don't know NBA stuff. Let's do esports. Esports. Ask me about Smash players. That's what's gonna be it. Like it's. Oh yeah, we won. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We've been going about two fifteen. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta get ready to go somewhere. All right. Um, I, I don't want to leave, leave you guys in a lurch. No, that's okay. A lot that, of fun, but... that was. We've been going a while. interesting we'll enough. There. GGs. Well, was, this is actually there hasn't been a really bad. Uh, there hasn't been a bad game this block. Uh, Not so really. Boomerang is my favorite. Yeah, uh, my Quick favorite sword, is Kior. Probably my least favorite. That a Boomerang. Uh, which one? Uh, non sensory or Quick Sword? Quicksort was fun. Uh, Quicksort is fun with more people, I think. I didn't love you... any of them, but uh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't really like, dislike any of them either. Yeah, I think Nonsensory was my favorite. Yeah, yeah. my favorite. My favorite is either Junktopia uh, or Rumoring. Honestly, oh no, was Junktopia fun. was my favorite. Rumoring, yeah. Rumoring was fun as fuck. That we was. Could, that uh, was... We come back and play some of these again with different people. We need with more yeah. people. Yeah. We need we need more people for this. This is this has been a this is a fun this is a fun pack. I like this pack. They they really uh like honed in on like what on like uh what makes it fun, I think, for this I'm one. I'm glad they were I guess paying attention to what people were playing. Yeah. Alright, that's it for today. I'm gonna call it. Thank you guys for playing, and thanks to anyone who is watching. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace. Catch y'all later.